Hi, Mike's Cover Your Parts here. In this video, we're going to talk about throttle body problems and uh, what to watch for. Who doesn't like to have a trouble free car ownership experience and enjoy comfortable driving? With so many, <clears throat> with so much going on under the hood of a car, anything could go wrong and hamper your car's performance. As a car owner, one must know about the basic engine parts, their function, and common symptoms so they can be fixed once the trouble arises. A throttle body is one of the main components of your engine, one without which your car won't work. It is part of the air intake system and essentially a valve that regulates the airflow into the engine via the intake manifold. If something goes wrong with the throttle body, you'd notice a bunch of symptoms and problems with your car's performance. Let's have a look at some of the common symptoms of a bad throttle body and what you should look out and what you should look out for. The throttle body is either electronic, driven by a motor or manual, controlled by a wire. No matter which type, you should keep an eye on these symptoms and get your car checked immediately once you notice something odd. Rough idling. This is one of the earliest signs of a faulty throttle body. As your engines can't get the optimal air fuel mixture, the combustion process inside the engine gets hampered. If your car idles roughly or shivers a lot while sitting, it is highly likely that something has gone wrong with the throttle body. Sluggish acceleration. Another common symptom of a bad throttle body is sloppy acceleration. Once you push the gas pedal, you literally feel that your car is limping and not responding, responding as it should be. Irrespective of the rev count, your engine won't be able to perform anywhere near its best when the throttle body is damaged. Engine misfire. This is rather a drastic symptom of a bad throttle body and appears at a later stage. If the throttle body totally fails or gets blocked due to any reason, the engine would misfire as it won't be receiving the needed air for the mixture to form and proper combustion to occur. When you notice this sign, it's time to take your car immediately to the workshop. Poor fuel economy. Needless to mention that when the combustion process inside the engine isn't occurring properly, it won't be able to give the ideal output and most of it would go to waste. Fuel economy is also an indicator of your car's performance and once the throttle body goes bad, the air fuel mixture would not be formed optimally and the engine would rather stall than give those extra miles per gallon. If you see your fuel gauge needle dropping quickly, it's time to get a checkup from the mechanic. Engine stalling. If your engine keeps stalling and doesn't respond prop promptly to the accelerator input, it is likely that the throttle body has become faulty. With, whether idling or running, a perfectly running engine should respond immediately to the driver's input and if it fails to do so, something has gone wrong and it most probably is a bad throttle body. Getting it checked and fixed is the only way out of this problem. Check engine light blinking. Like other parts of the engine, the throttle body also features some sensors and electric, electronic parts. If something goes wrong with any of those, the car's ECU would pick up an error during the routine scan and blink the check engine light. This is the easiest and most reliable indicator of any underlying fault, but is difficult to diagnose as well, as there could be a problem with any part of the engine and you've got to pinpoint it by deciphering the error codes. Idling at higher RPMs. When the throttle body doesn't work properly, the engine struggles to get the required air for the combustion process to occur. To curb this issue, it idles at higher RPMs to meet the need and get that extra breathing space. If you feel that your car sits at higher RPMs than normal, even after driving for a while, it could be a sign of a bad throttle body. Poor performance. Another obvious sign of a bad throttle body is your car's poor and below par performance. If the throttle body is faulty, you feel like your car has different problems. 
like shivering while idling, poor economy and no acceleration. All of this points towards poor performance as your car doesn't give optimal output and keeps stalling most of the time. You get a feeling that if the gas pedal is loose or even not connected to the engine at all. This is probably a late symptom of a bad throttle body and needs to be checked before the engine gives up completely. Finally, I must stress how crucial it is to recognize and act promptly whenever you sense something odd or of any of these signs of a bad throttle body express themselves. It determines the dependability of your car and your own safety when on the road. The check engine light coming on or rough for idle or increased fuel consumption are all sufficient reasons to inspect the throttle body. Another issue with cars is usually simply to remedy, simple to remedy, but can result in significant issues if not addressed promptly. So to enjoy the best performance and fuel economy, maintain your car religiously and get it fixed if a problem knocks. So here at Mike's Carburetor and Injector Parts, we have a wide assortment of uh, injector parts for you to choose from. So when you're ready to work on your throttle body, please uh, give our website a uh, visit at mikescarb.com. And I uh, thank you for watching our videos. Appreciate it. Thank you very much.